Hey guys, what's up? First tutorial in a long time, I know we're all shocked. It's free tech support and uh yeah, it's Vince. Today I'm gonna show you how to make this cool background or whatever with uh Photoshop. It's pretty cool. Uh so yeah, let's get started. File oh, okay. First you wanna do is file new uh width is whatever height whatever make sure that uh instead of inches it's set to pixels or just make sure it's set to pixels background contents doesn't matter because we're going to be changing that anyways and click ok go ahead and delete that okay so first thing you want to do is make your foreground color black take your paint bucket tool and paint it all black um, you want to make a new layer, go to filter, render, call, oh, and then change, before you do that, change it to, uh, your foreground color to white, filter, render clouds, okay, that's not good, alright, make your background color black, alright, Okay, so then change, go right here, change it to overlay. All right, and you're like, what the hell, man? All right, just select background again. You'll see, uh, make a new layer and uh, change it to any color you like. I'm going to make it to a greenish color. Select your brush tool, uh, hardness zero, master diameter. Just make it to where it's a little bit bigger than your picture, just so it can run off a little bit as a little bit better effect. And just click once. And then, so that's pretty cool right there, right? Yeah, we all know it. But uh, we're going to add some more colors. So I'm going to add this color. Uh, you can bring your brush down a little. Uh, probably like around 422, depending on what your size is. And let's keep doing this. I'm just going to select some random colors. Uh, what other color should I use? How about this purplish color? It'd look pretty cool. Alright. So next you want to take your text. Uh, you can just make as many texts as you want. So, make sure to make it white. That'll help. Free. Alright, just put it wherever you want. Make it whatever colors you want, but I'm going to be doing other stuff later. Making it look cooler. Alright, make it again. This time, uh... Just make it a little bit bigger. So I'm going to make it instead of 48. Just go to next size, which is 60. Try and center it. Alright. And the last one. Of course. Support. Of course. Alright, just make this a little bit bigger. Bring that to 72. Just adds a neat, neat little effect. So uh, the font I used was Impact. Uh, nothing real special. So, okay. So you just want to right-click whatever the last one was. Blending options. Go to gradient overlay. Mm, I'm just going to select a default one right here. Just to save a little bit of time. But you can pick whatever one you want. Right, and then go to bevel and boss, and I'll just put the size all the way down. It still has a little bit of bevel, uh, but it still looks really good. So, once you're done adding all your blending options, whatever you want, just, uh, you can right-click on it, copy layer style, paste it on the next one, paste it on the other one, so it adds it to all of them. And last, <laughs> uh, sorry. Haven't done a tutorial in a while, so 
Alright, next you want to take the pen tool and just start making a neat little path. Um, so. I'm just going to make a little weird one. Uh, it might take a while to get a one that you would like. Alright, so when you're done with that, uh, make sure that your brush, you want to bring the master diameter down to about 20, that'll be the best effect. And then select your pen tool again, right click on the path you made, and stroke path. Make sure it's selected on brush, and simulate pressure should be checked, and click OK, and then enter, and there you go, you got your cool little wisp. And you can just go ahead and save it as whatever i recommend a png adds more uh it's just better for the environment no <laughs> but that'd be cool though uh so i'm just gonna title it awesomeness and uh just save it interlace will help it if you're gonna use it for a video uh it just adds like more hd all right so then we got picture right here all right pretty sick looking just mess around with it the strokes probably the key point of this video all right so this has been free tech support and see you guys next time peace out